The content of this show is meant to be humorous. It is based off of our own creative thinking as a gift to your ears. However, the Bean and Superbad show may not be suitable for people who can't take a joke, people who get butthurt too easily, people who have an inflated ego, people who cry themselves to sleep, people who suffer from excessive shrinking of testicles due to steroid use, or for people who find themselves obsessively posting anything and everything they can. These are features of shows they work for and couldn't cut it because it's way too much work and they're way too fucking busy. What we're trying to say is, it's just entertainment. Enjoy. And you're welcome. Warning, the following comedy program may contain opinions, facts, news stories, and other content that may be offensive to the following people. Anyone easily offended, anyone leaning too far left, anyone leaning too far right, anyone who used to work on the show, anyone who works at STLR, anybody whose on-air name is the same as a basis from Avenged Sevenfold, anyone who's racist, anyone who takes social media seriously, hell, anyone who takes anything too seriously, and most importantly, anybody who's PC. The BS show is not politically correct, nor do they practice or support political correctness in any way, shape, or form. If you're offended, turn us off. Don't be a bitch. Basically, what we're trying to say is just entertainment. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. You're welcome. When life gives you lemons make lemonade i read that once on a can of lemonade but i like to think that it applies to life i don't want lemonade it's too sweet and it makes my tongue feel gritty so maybe it's time for a change starting now when life gives me lemons i'm gonna slice them up into wedges and throw them into vodka tonics which i will then sip in a burlesque nightclub that i co-own with actor tay Diggs and two of the pussycat dolls Oh, 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 oh. girl go up there, like, into her elbow. Re- and that's whoa. Me by your shit pushed in. <laughs> went to her elbow? Like, she went to the point where her bed was really high off the floor, and she had a low ceiling fan. I almost died by death of ceiling fan. <laughs> oh, that shocked me. Those are the people whoa. who don't know what just happened. <laughs> it has all For my For some sound. reason, there was a here. picture of a penis. It was my penis. <laughs> of Superbath's penis on... My oh, tablet. <laughs> your your tablet just lying on the table. So now me and Bean have officially seen Super Bad Penis. <laughs> I'm not trying to put my penis out there like that. My bad. Oh my god. If you don't know, now you know. <laughs> You're listening to the BS show. It is BS show. We are live, I think, somehow. Live. First time we've been live in a long, long time. Long are we? Time. Are we sure we're happy live? Wednesday? Oh no, I'm. I you know I'm sure. Okay. Happy Wednesday, Sorry. November twentieth, twenty nineteen. This Ooh. is just uh, it's just me, GMFB, and uh, Radio Man sitting here. R- 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 Radio Man. No murder. Radio Man. Shouldn't it be Radio Boy? Radio Boy. Radio Boy. It sounds I, better I, until I get laid. <laughs> sounds hot. Are we officially? Are we no? Okay, I, 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 no, I can't be Radio Boy because GMFB wants me to be Radio Boy. I don't know if I want you to be Radio Boy. You said or you did, you man. I'm not putting Radio words Boy. in your mouth, but I guess I do want you to be Radio Boy. <laughs> I, I like that. No though. one else said it. I'll take it. I, I kind of like it's that. It's like a sidekick. I think Murdoch would have agreed with that. I'll I'll take it. Me my, and him twin so hard, he would definitely. My agree. shirt does say Radio Man. So we we'll can always to, get a new like, shirt. We should just like tape it over and write boy. <laughs> like, like, <laughs> do duct tape classic, on it. Yeah, classic like BS show move. <laughs> <laughs> That's I'll, I'll do that tonight. That would be am wonderful. I am I officially radio boy? You're a radio boy. All right. I'll take it. Until I get laid. <laughs> then I then I'm a man. Then I can be radio man again. He's gonna, he talks like this, and then he's going to come in after he gets laid. He's going to be like, yeah, now I'm radio so man. I'm, yeah. I'm radio man. <laughs> Voice is going to drop a couple of octaves. <laughs> yeah, I'm radio man. So tonight, we just, we're just it's just us three. We're going to screw around a little while I make sure that the stream well, is... I don't want to screw around if uh, it's you two in the room. <sighs> while I make sure the stream is up and running well for Friday, which I know you won't be here, right, GMFB, on Friday? Friday is my anniversary. That's your anniversary. Some lame excuse. Happy anniversary. Yeah. You, oh no, you know I'm the so, first. I'm so happy for you and Frank. <laughs> <laughs> He's a very lucky man. Well, how come Frank's gonna be here? Wait a minute. <laughs> Five years I've been married. Damn. Five I still years. Haven't gotten laid. You only been I married. S- you only been married five years. <laughs> yeah, together like ten though. I was gonna say I thought you've been married longer than that. No, my daughter is six. Yeah. So. Okay, I started doing the math over here. <laughs> it's like something. He's got a, he's got a calculator Hold on. out. The green. My visor, abacus. Like... I'm moving the. <laughs> Do you know what's really terrible is I know how old my daughter is, but I have I also I do a subtract one to know how long we've been married because like for some reason I was like oh we've been married like three years and then I'm like no Ellie's six so that would make it five years yeah got to do a little long do math division. man yeah. good thing it's only subtracting one yeah. oh, dude subtracting two <laughs> that's a whole new cup of tea I don't even want to brew <sighs> why did you just burn it. <laughs> A cup of tea that I don't want to brew. I just, I just did that on the spot. You like that? That was good. <laughs> I uh, enjoyed tonight, it. Right? Tonight, I did. That's it pretty, pretty much good. the the. That's gonna be the tonight's show, basically. Right Fireside there. Chat, a, a cup of Two. tea that we don't want to brew. Yeah. No. Just that. That pretty much is the uh, the vibe. I think. Uh, Radio Man's gonna 
I'm sorry, Radio Boy. Radio uh, Boy. Excuse me, he's been demoted. <laughs> da, 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 da. Is going to do his Radio Boy. Is going to do his hypothetically speaking bit, which if you don't know what that is, he'll explain in a minute. Um, I just want to remind everybody, Friday we should be pretty close to full power, right? I think everyone will be here but GMFB. Full power. Uh, Radio Man is going out as oh, GMFB. Have you ever seen Chef Boyard Dick? <laughs> the costume? Do you want me to no. die? He's just outside of here. Did you see? Um. <laughs> okay, okay. Did you not see that? Okay, you have to get you on your Instagram. He has an Instagram yeah. that he never gets on. Okay, his <laughs> wife set up a show Instagram, radio personality really? Instagram for him. He has no idea. No and idea. every time you us three are talking, I do, I tag him. He <laughs> exists. And he'll go, I don't have one. And I hear his wife in the back go, Yes, you do. But he never exactly gets on. To be works. fair, I can't even sign into my main radio uh, uh, Instagram account. I'm just into Radio Man. Well, my Instagram's Radio one. Man now, That's so should I, I have to change it to Radio Boy, right? Radio yeah, Boy. I'll do it right now. Um, so Chef Boy Mer- Dick. Chef, Chef Boy Dick. It's something we created a couple couple years ago. Wait, it's not something that was already out there. It doesn't no. make sense. It just seems <laughs> like that should be out there. Um, how did somebody miss out on that? I don't know. That's a great I don't know Halloween how costume. Let's that? just say Murdoch found out that more people listen to this show than he thought because we took a video because he had never seen the co- part of the mm-hmm. costume for mm-hmm. it before. So we put Frank in it, and then we had him go to go to. And the picture is like, what's about to happen in this picture? Like it looks like, like Murdoch and and Cherokee oh, the one that you showed me. Yeah, yeah, about to get down. And Murdoch's like lifting. Like, up. Yeah, like what's okay. happening there? <laughs> right. Yeah. So Murdoch's like, dude, I've got people reaching out to me going, what's, uh, what were we doing with that guy and why were we reaching under his? So you want to, you want to put it on and show? You want me to don it? Yeah. Okay. Don't, don't spoil it until you get on. Jim, Jim, don't look at it. Let him, let him put oh, it on. You can't tell me that. It's He's going to show you. He's just got, let him get it on first. Now, I want you to picture this outfit. Let's get it on. When, when he does get it on, he's going to have uh, a hairnet. <laughs> okay. And then he's going to have, like, yellow dishwashing gloves. Okay. I think he should wear a hairnet all the we're gonna, time. We're going right, to sit. Look now. Okay, so this is what it, this is part of it right here. It's all he did was put on an apron. You right. made me turn away for that. Now, hold on, hold on. Let's, oh, wait. Can you move the bottle, Radio Man? Because I want to get the... We're going to compare uh, video. Um, special surprise in China. <laughs> <laughs> I can see something. There's a, there's a special surprise. Something in my front pocket for you. Looks you ever see like that South Park? Be. Mm, a special surprise. Something in my front pocket for you. <laughs> all right, so we're filming now. In this, all right. Uh, so, GMFB. Yes. Ready, man, get a little closer for me. Get a closer. I don't know there if I want him closer. There you go. Okay. It, all right. He's so. packing. Yeah, <laughs> That's <heat> creepy. He's <laughs> 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 doing his hair. Am I supposed to lift this up? Yeah, go ahead. Is it? Is it? Is it just the first one? Right. Yeah, just the first one. <laughs> Lift it all the way up, though. Watch what it does. <laughs> Pull it. <laughs> How excited! <laughs> Do you hear that laugh? He's, He's clapping. That's spectacular! He's really oh man! <laughs> That's wonderful. So we're oh. so Radio Man's gonna go out Friday with the last of our stock of what this run of T-shirts we had, mm-hmm. and we're gonna see who who we can get, guy or girl, to do the most ridiculous thing with it. Hopefully, girl for his sake, obviously. Yes. Um, and then they win t- <laughs> they win a T-shirt. And he, I mean, whoever he I'm chooses, he, head, you look yes. like you were afraid for it. Being no, he <laughs> did look genuinely yeah. like he hopes it's women for you. I, I will give him credit. <laughs> Dude, he was like, I told you what would happen. I'm getting in my car and I'm fucking leaving. <laughs> So you'll get to choose who gets the T-shirts. You'll get to choose the winner. We're gonna send probably Cherokee down with them to film where, it. Where though? Downtown. Okay. So that's it's happening on busy. Friday. Yeah, it's getting town's busy. town's getting packed. That so. leads me Hop to uh, another segment I want to announce. I'm trying to have it by next Monday. If not, we'll have it the week after Thanksgiving. But we're gonna do um, ask a gay guy, but for real. <laughs> I'm trying to decide like a real like. But for real. But b u t t for wasn't real. Saying that. <laughs> that's 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 too low of a hanging fruit, man. That's you can't. They just grab even GMFB is going. <laughs> he's shaking his head in such such disappointment. You know, you didn't hear what he just said. You said low hanging fruit. He goes, they just grab him. What are you talking about? You? <laughs> yeah. Oh. The low hanging fruit. You just grab dudes. it. <laughs> no, you just the, <laughs> the butt. Yes. God. So um, yeah. So uh, uh, his name oh. uh, his name's Eric. He is ready for this. He is not afraid. He wants – I told him all you guys are going to have, like, five questions each-ish this time and any questions you want. 
anything. <laughs> he, I mean, we're not doing terrestrial pretend garbage. I mean, this is like whatever. Any question you'd ever want to ask a gay guy ever? Is it, curiosity, it's like a game show, kind of. <laughs> da, 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 da. Gmf, ask a gay guy. He's already got one because he already threw one at me. So, yeah. I mean, I yeah. I think it's a good I'm sure idea you have a lot of because I think I it really takes do. I think it takes a lot of the stig- more stigma out of the stuff and it makes it makes it funny. Mm. And if I knew a if I knew a trans person that I could talk talk into doing this, I'd be all over that too. Oh, serious? Because I, they're quite. If people know more, it's less that you can make fun of. Do you know what I mean? Seriously, oh, you're one hundred percent right. It's like the more you know, but like a com- a comedic twist on it. Like I really want to know: Can gay guys have missionary sex? So he's already got. He is Mission- ready. He has got questions loaded. I watched it. I, I'm telling you, watch the show <laughs> Animal Kingdom. They have missionary sex in it, two dudes, and and I turned to Nicole and I'm like, did did that just happen? Did they just have missionary sex? I'm like, how does how does that work? I'm sure you got like a whole notepad, <laughs> taking notes. Like, like here, one day, I need a diagram, sir. One day I'm gonna be on a show and there's gonna be a segment where we ask a gay dude questions. I'm hoping that's Monday. Uh, the other thing we have. I'm ha- hoping have, it's every day. The other thing we're gonna. I'm gonna try to do that at least once <laughs> a month. We'll bring him in, if not mm-hmm. once every couple weeks. Yeah. Oh yeah. The uh, the turkey the turkey hunt is looking like it's gonna fall okay, through. Okay, I listened to a show previously, and someone said Thanksgiving. So <sighs> Cherokee Thanksgiving. <laughs> oh my God, who said it? I think it was Murdoch. Someone. Oh, it was it was Murdoch. Of course or, he did. Or maybe makes you sense or something. I don't know. Mm. But I don't it, think that came from me. It looks like the turkey thing's gonna fall through, though. Unfortunately, for this year, wow. so I've got a backup plan that I think we're gonna do a stunt where um, uh, Team Patrick actually found this list of the worst uh, Thanksgiving food recipes of all time Ooh. that got like made. Of <laughs> You're already like, oh god. Ooh. So and I'm we're skimming- putting it into a shade. <laughs> no <laughs> <laughs> shit. <laughs> A Thanksgiving shake yeah. of the worst Thanksgiving. Oh, Thanksgiving! Foods. I wasn't even thinking about doing a shake. Yeah, it's you're been welcome. more than a year since we've done it, so I feel like we can go back to that well now. That was a long time ago. It has I'd been over a year. It. No, no, this was going to be for all of us. I was going to pick the three to five worst things, and we were going to make them and bring them in. And then for Ooh. Thanksgiving on Monday, we were all going to do like our own little well, BS listen, show Thanksgiving feast. You can't have me make. I'm uh, like a master chef. Okay. No matter what I make, it's going to so taste if it's awesome. So you top don't five terrible foods. You'll just yeah. make it taste. It's going to taste. It's going to be spectacular. You guys are going to be like, this is the best thing I ever had. So, are you I, hashtag humble today? Or I do like where your head's at t- though with the uh, with the um with the shake with the shake. Maybe we do convert it into a shake. I'll drink the shake. I have. I think I feel like I have to redeem myself. You know, I'll attempt to drink the shake. No, you can't say I'll attempt. I, I'm not saying I say, will. You have to say I, I, I will. You have to set your mind to it and get the mindset well, I that I'm going to do out. this. You see that? Man. Uh-oh. Oh. Get it just no, you're good. You got, you got the sniffles, and it's it's just. Oh, is that that was me? I thought that was the, you. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a ghost. Also, we're officially announcing tonight uh, Murdoch versus R- Radio Boy. Radio boy, hair versus hair, the really the hair Olympics, the hair off. I have not. W- we haven't decided. He's got some thick hair. We here, haven't decided the boy. game, but the loser, the loser gets their head buzzed. Yes. Oh yeah. I've been. How long have you been growing that for? I told Murdoch well, I, I was announcing head. it tonight, and he was he sent me so many expletives with yeses and exclamation <laughs> points. He's so pumped for this. Really? Yeah. Because you remember he showed up one day for when we were recording the other show, and he showed up all clean cut, like clean shaven, it's clean like a year cut. ago. Yeah. And I'm he walked in. I I didn't know who he was when he walked into my house. I, I'm like, who's him this guy? and Radio Man get haircuts like annually. That's their deal. They I don't just go. got my haircut. Uh, like a couple weeks ago, you, and it I was, was going to say you can, he, he looks like one. Doc Brown now. His hair's a lot shorter. <laughs> he looks like Back to the Future Two length. I'm trying to think of I'll who he it. looks like, like a like young Doc Brown. <laughs> I'll for sure take it. <laughs> Sideshow Radio- Bob a little bit. Radio Boy Brown. Sideshow Bob. I looked like Sideshow Bob before mm-hmm. with my hair. Yeah, you, said he, you got like three or four, kind of three or four inches lobbed off there. I got three and a half. Yep. Last time they took off six inches of my hair. Look how fluffy it is. Though. It is. It is fluffy. Do you blow dry it to get it that way? No. Oh, it's just natural. Yeah. And he, did you see? <laughs> it's he just natural. Did it in the back and you see. Oh yeah, look at my head. Oh. It's bouncy. It feels nice. Bouncy. <laughs> <laughs> it feels great on the back of my neck. 
So we're going to try to squeeze most of that stuff into next week. I know next week's Thanksgiving Thanksgiving week. Thanksgiving. So Franksgiving week. <laughs> Franksgiving. So chances are we're probably only going to do a show Monday. We were supposed to do three shows this week. We're already down to two. So I mean, <laughs> Friday we're not. Fucking par for the course. Things oh. never goddamn change. Uh, Friday? How are we down to two? Because we didn't do a show Monday. Your yeah, math is oh, so well, weak. We did a show last Friday, right? We did. So I was kind of looping that. That was oh, last well, thank week. You. Yeah. Friday, it was so good, it counts as both. Yeah, it's well, fine. I mean, Thanks it was so ra- close to Monday, so like, whatever. I like Radio Boy better Radio than Radio Boy. Man. <laughs> I'm kind of growing, it's growing on me rapidly. <laughs> you, well, you can change the last word, because people either like shorten it to just Radio or Radio Man. It's Radio Boy. I, actually, I'm a, it's Radio Boy. <laughs> I reference you as Radio when I'm talking to Nicole. That's what I'm saying. Well, a lot yeah. of us do. Everybody yeah. says Radio. Yeah. It's weird. It, but it I like that it's Bean me. and Adventures of Bean and Radio Boy. It could be like Keaton Batman and, and Robin. Boy. I'll take it. Yeah, I'm kind of like your sidekick. So I, I'm Radio Man never. Makes Where's sense. Radio Boy? And then it, oh, he's at home smoking weed. You so easily take oh, the sidekick like, role. It's like a bong rip, but into the Batman like theme. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> never seen somebody want to be Robin so he's easily. So excited. Oh, I'll, totally be, <laughs> I'll oh, take Robin. I'll, I'll be Robin. I'll, I'll be Stoner Robin any day. Are you crazy? Do I get to play in the Batcave? Yeah. I just get to get really high and play in the Batcave. Speaking of Stoner Robin. Uh, Hypothetically it, speaking. It's your night to shine. What if Robin was a stoner? So we're gonna play this. One. We're gonna play this game that Radio Man came up with, which is basically just an excuse for him to get extremely high and come up with what if, excellent what excuse, if scenarios though. where we're supposed to ponder what happens if these things happen, and most of the time. <laughs> Like, it goes horribly wrong. Most yeah, seventy percent of, of them were just like, "That's want. really not good." Next one, and then but then every once in a while he hits one. Mm-hmm. It was pretty pretty good, you know. So you got to wade through a lot of crap to get to thirty <laughs> percent is okay, you know. If thirty percent, if he's of playing them are baseball, good, yeah. if yeah. he's batting three hundred, that's yeah. I'll take it. He's a it's starter fine. in the MLB. I'll take it. Well, if he plays for Houston, you know, he'd be stealing signals. <laughs> Murdoch's not here. Yeah, he, he acted know, like he got the joke too. I like you, radio. You acted I like laughed you got for the joke. The on air. I, I gave you the respect of a pity laugh. <laughs> <laughs> like, yuck, a sympathy yuck, yuck. laugh. Yeah. <laughs> I get those at home. Come on. <laughs> All right, let's are go. You, let's... Are you ready for a hypothetically speaking? Yeah. Okay, if I didn't nail the name, you wouldn't have coined. Uh, 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 what's the word? A OK? What's the. Approved? Greenlit. 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 Okay, greenlit we'll go my with bit. Greenlit. Yeah. <laughs> my segment. Just to make but it I wait, did, so why are you debating whether I should have... Well, because if I didn't have a great name, you probably wouldn't have. True. Mm-hmm. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, if it would have been a bad name, Jay would have If it was just like, hey, dude, a better, a I'm going to get name. really high and say some dumb shit, and that's I'd be just like, that's happen. what you do all the time, <laughs> so what's the difference as opposed to... This is we just named it. <laughs> <laughs> we just named it. Getting we got high. a little of it under control, <laughs> yeah. and and we named it. It's under a category, at least. you know. Hypothetically speaking. Speaking but it's spelled H-I-G. With Radio Boy. Radio Boy. Radio Boy. I got to push up He my touches glasses. his glasses like he, it changes his voice. <laughs> I can't wait to have the cameras like, live I up like in here. push him up or whatever. All right. He's like, hey, my name is Ryan. <laughs> Radio, I'm Radio, Radio Boy. Boy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, number one. Uh, all right, hold on. You've got me in a bad spot here. Okay, <laughs> well, 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 shut up. If you had the power to make a sinkhole, where would you put one? <laughs> At the White House. Oh Jesus! Wow, there was Christ. there was <laughs> no hesitation. Point five milliseconds. Wow. On that one. Am I the only one who thinks that? It'd, be, it'd be Washington. Start Spread the out. stopwatch Washington. and stop. <laughs> Gonna say, did you let him see what was happening before? Right at the White House, yeah. just the whole thing would be sucked into the earth. Okay, yeah. I wasn't prepared for that, but I thought you were gonna know. say like there's some prob- what, what, neighbor. There's probably like... some innocent people there. Are you want when there's like no tours <laughs> and stuff, right? Like at night. No, right now. Oh no, no. That's right now, be. there's a. I mean, sometimes you happens. know, there's collateral damage sometimes in in things like this. You know, you can't. He's help a super it. villain. We're live, right? He's so I can say right now. Live. Yeah, right now. <laughs> Su- right, radio boy, the villain. <laughs> Is there a wrong answer here? I'm I'm Is that... Robin when he becomes no wrong answer. I didn't no. say an orphanage. Red Hood. No, you didn't. But I'm just saying, what if if you don't give it a time frame, it could be like they happen to. That school, you I'm know, saying uh, at the moment I say what are those these schools in New York the call, they all have numbers, like you know. Oh yeah, public school PS. Yeah, you PS seven two eight seven four has been scrapping their entire lives to get there. It's their eighth grade trip, sinkhole. and then the sinkhole opens up <laughs> because you didn't specify the time, GMFB. Mm. It just costs all those poor innocent oh, there's kids. Children at the way. Yeah. What time? Let's say a time. He doesn't uh, care. He's yeah. let that be known that yeah. he's like, when those children are there, when yeah. those children, are there. yeah, especially specifically, when the kids are there. he's like, thanks for notifying me. 
<laughs> right? More death. <laughs> there has to be something wrong with them. They wanted to go to the White House. You wouldn't do Ooh. like a, a really tall building, so it would just like sink all well, the you, way in. You don't know who's going like to be in it. Burj Khalifa. Burj Khalifa. Look it up. <laughs> <laughs> he just murdocked me. It's a. Uh, Holy a- shit. <laughs> wow. I have no idea what he's it's talking in, about what's either. That? He, like, he channeled. What's that? He looked on. at me dead in the eyes and went, Look it up. Don't make me explain myself. Look it up, Whoa. bro. Look up Burj Khalifa. It's a giant Is it ass like building. Wiz Khalifa? It's in Bali or what's that place where all the rich people are? Oh, Bali. Uh, Dubai? Dubai. Dubai. Bollywood. It's in Dubai. Bali. Bali. Whatever. It's the same. It's Bollywood. I, Bollywood. Same thing. Wow. That's not racist at all. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Oh anyway, well, where Bur- would you guys put a sinkhole? The Burj Khalifa in, the Burj- in Dubai. Okay. Um, <laughs> it's a really wow. tall building. You, so you just want the building to disappear? Yeah, I just wanted to watch it sink all the way down. I when wanted- there's nobody in it. Now, do clarify. I get do I get to do I get to determine the size of the sinkhole? Yeah, can it be a smaller one? It'll it'll fill the object that you want to. to I want sink. one next to the leaning tower on the other <laughs> side, the leaning tower of Pisa, to straighten the thing out. Just on the edge, just so it can just be. And you're like the tower of Pisa. <laughs> you're like, okay, open the sinkhole and and close it, close it. Close yeah, it, boom, cool. per- like, perfect. How has that thing not fallen over though? I think they actually keep it up like with constantly. They're, oh, they they're, now it's like a battle to keep it from falling. Oh, it's like made like that. You think? No, it no, wasn't no, originally it, made like that. But they've probably like made it like. Well, over it started the years, to right? fall, but now they have to keep it up because. Oh. But it's not like anyone goes inside it. No, I right? think it's empty. It is. No, like everybody hollow. pretends to kick it over in their long distance <laughs> shitty photos that don't make sense. When you're one of the guy that you're taking the picture and you're holding it <laughs> up, hypothetically and then that's speaking, the actual time when it flips comes over and the guy <laughs> gets crushed trying to take a stupid picture. Man, those are the worst guys. pictures. They are there. I did one when I was in Vegas where with uh, the ball on the top of what is it? Where is it? It looks like it, and I'm like spinning it on my I finger. I've never been to Vegas. It's a big ball like on the strip on top of a hotel. I know this looks a like a basketball. I think it is, or I like Planet Hollywood or something. I don't. I forget is that place. Still and I'm and I'm doing it yeah, like it's so. on my finger, like I'm spinning it on my finger. I just said those pictures are dumb. He's like, they are the worst. Now I did it. I uh, did one. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I said they're the worst. I don't know if you said that. <laughs> I did. I love doing those stupid pictures, though. They are the worst. If but you could come up with a new original one and set the trend for the new ones, that's cool. I'm fine with that. Ooh, but when movie. you're the 87,000th person, you know, and, you're and like, you think it's funny, and like I'm surprised you weren't doing some like tickling the ball gesture, <laughs> where <laughs> you look like you got a mouthful <laughs> to the ball, <laughs> like at, at Caesar at the fountains, you're like tickling it and it's squirting out. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And off Hypothetically the rails we go. speaking, okay. If a stripper got a boob job, is it a tax write off? Yeah, it should be. It's work related. I was gonna say, I don't know if that's hypothetical. It's probably you can probably. I just wanted to know. If you got a good. <laughs> this is personal <laughs> yeah. innocent knowledge for radio. My man. manager wanted me to to put that on the air because he listens to my show. <laughs> Oh, my show, Radio out. Boy that's Show. Now I'm yeah. sure if you're like her tax guy, you need to feel them to make sure that yeah, they're up right? to code. Just to make sure they're legit. Does somebody have to come in? And All right, that was kind of a throwaway. All right, someone in the room turns into a bean. Who do we choose? Do, do we choose bean? bean, or do we choose someone like else? what? Ki- like me turn into me? Like a, a pinto bean? Oh, what? He started know. so strong. Yeah, that's um. These that's, are the weak ones. I'm saying that's where you you go. <laughs> that's a strikeout. This time we. This if somebody time... was to turn into a bean, who would it be? <laughs> yeah, and his name is Bean. Yeah, would you? <laughs> tur- would we turn him terrible. into a bean? So we want Bean to turn into a bean. Oh my, no, who would where's you my want to? Cheesy sound effects, so I can <laughs> hit buttons here. Look, okay, I was very high. All right, is it cannibalistic if he eats beans? What? Like oh, a as bean a bean? eating a bean? Yeah, bean. Well, he's not like. Bean. He's not like Bean Bean, you know? He's just a bean. Okay. Next one. He's yeah. not like, it's not like <laughs> a Pickle Rick situation, you know? Skip. I'm Bean Bean. I'm going to do what my daughter does when I play Dave Matthews. Skip. Next next track. Okay. You know how like animals <laughs> chase like a, a light, like a red Oh, the laser light, pointer? A laser pointer. I want you to name me, like, how long do you think it'll take for them to not do that? Like, years. Never. If, Never, if an like animal evolutionary is, wait, what? for them to evolve to, to, not, to, not, want to g- not want the red light. It's not in their nature. Never? No. You never you don't think it's gonna happen in like a billion a, years or something? And, no, I don't think so, because it's just in their nature to hunt. All right. A cat? 
Yeah. I don't or think like so. Or like fish even do it, man. Oh, really? Yeah. I had a fish that would swim in circles. Would go upside down in a circle and really? swim. Yeah. You you never came to my house. That big parrot fish that I had, the cichlid, the orange one, he would swim and do circles. Because he was dying? or No, he would just get bored and start swimming, doing loops. There's but a hypothetical. What if you got turned into a fish? <laughs> And stuck into it. Yeah. Tank. Okay. Sorry. Oh. But with your human, we choose consciousness. someone to. How about to turn miserable into a life? Oh my god! Like, what would you do? You're always in there, and nothing changes. Like, you'd be I, stuck watching Pittsburgh Steelers games all, all the time. The time. Constantly. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So hypothetically speaking, I get it. You love Jerome Bettis. Your phone now records you every time you look at it. I don't think You're, that's hypothetical. Yeah, that's you're into all your facial expressions and then post it to your social media account. Would you delete your social media, or what would you? Would you not have a phone anymore, or what would you I mean, do to without you? Without okay. your consent, yeah, it just like does it now. Hypothetically, what about oh. if it? What about every time you're in the bathroom? Yeah, yeah that's your, what I'm saying. Video. Every time you open your phone and are looking at it, it just record. It starts recording you. <laughs> He's so happy. <laughs> All these are for GMFB. I know they and are. And then it posts it to your social media that you don't even know you have. In my fantasy football league, I played one of my friends, and I kicked his butt, and I recorded myself while I was taking a dump talking crap to him and making the sound effects and everything. like Not sound effects, like the actual noises. And I'm like, hey, Jason, this is me because I just took a crap on your season. and I just took a... And I did, and I squeezed. <laughs> I squeezed it out. It was, it was wonderful. I only shared it with him, and normally I send those kind of things to everybody. Yeah, but I thank you. I kept it. Just, yeah. <laughs> thank you. I appreciate that. We radio. I'm gonna get him some for Christmas now. We for should become me that friend's video. on Facebook no. so you can get run, run, my run. messenger stuff. Go, right, fo- guys, go. That's the end. Of hypothetically out. speaking, <laughs> have a good one. We're out of here. You're welcome. <laughs> But I'm, I actually think that's a pretty good one, though, about the your phone recording you and putting it directly to your social right? media. I would think, though, over the way the world's going is everyone would be okay with it. Well, see, I'm yeah, thinking as long as you know what's going to do it. I was going to say, I'm thinking right now that you're, you're being recorded all the time anyway. Mm-hmm. There's a good chance that someone it's can— It's not being posted. Either. No, but you're probably doing that for your FBI agent anyway who's sitting in his office, and he's like, oh, what's GMFB I'm up to? Oh, I wave to my camera again. every time oh, I jerk man. off. So. Do you set it up in front of you? Just, yeah, I'm like, just, hey— <laughs> this one's for you. <laughs> I'm looking at you, FBI. Here, here's to you, Special Agent Jack. Special Agent Jack off. <laughs> okay. Next one. Hypothetically speaking, say you had the power once a day to replace a broken object with another object somewhere else in the world that is totally fine. It So, like... As an example, if that lamp is broken, right, you could just trade it for any other lamp in the world. Like you just like I just like use my powers and go. And yeah. Like so now that there. other person has a shitty broken lamp and you have theirs. Do I get say of oh. where the shitty one comes from? What do you mean? Like if I need to replace this lamp, can I like? Go no, it's like, just a random lamp. I want to take it it'll from Radio a, Man. Oh, okay. It's, it'll be okay. a working lamp once a day. You have the power. So it's to one fix of those something. like push the buttons on the box where like you get a million dollars but somebody dies, but you don't know who it is randomly that dies. But this time I get a lamp. Or <laughs> no, whatever's wh- whatever broken. <laughs> right, if, right. if someone dies and you want a person, and then you get somebody else's grandmother. Broken. Whoa. Yeah, right. Can you replace a working object for a broken one? Yes. Because I would trade a you bell for the Liberty versa. Bell, and then Look I would take guy. the Liberty Bell. Here you go. And then I would lick it. That to had see more if it potential does than like I penny. thought it would. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you only have it once a day. Look, man. Once a day? That's a lot. I want to get into this shit. He texted me this morning saying, (laughs) hypothetically speaking, today. And how long have we known we're doing a fucking show on Wednesday? Like a month, two months. We're doing shows all this month. I don't get it, man. Well, he trailed off there with his aggression, I think. I know you tried to keep it going. Because he wasn't sure. How many shows are we doing? Because... One wait, we did two one? <laughs> because I eventually figured it out and I, I did it. Fingers, so. And now you're shitting on me that the questions aren't as good. So like, bro, that's part of the bit, I, Radio Boy. Radio, I actually radio like that boy. question though. But not every day. It could be once a year. I like every something. day because every day, once a month. How many things are you breaking? You just rip a hundred dollars. I would like the special power to be able to get into someone's house and change their clothes without them knowing, and then I would just 
slowly change the waist size of their clothes <laughs> to, to really screw with their mind so they oh. wouldn't know what was going on. They'd be like, oh, I'm losing so much here. weight. Oh, my God, I'm getting fat. What happened? But <laughs> this constant just just wouldn't know. You're like, if you had, like, the Infinity Gauntlet, you would just, like, use it to move, like, something, like, yeah, three inches. That, like. You don't understand. I want to do that. I want to break into someone's house I know and move everything over, like, four inches to the left. Just everything <laughs> in that house. Just so, like, you're running into stuff that just be like, what is happening? What like, Didn't they do that on an episode of that 70s show? It was the... Was it Tim the Tool Man Taylor? Oh, yeah. Psych- any, any, like, but to the left. Everything moves On that one. 70s show? Yeah. They did a Home Improvement crossover? Well, it was the guy from Home Improvement, oh, and he was like plays remodeling, oh, okay. remodeling the basement, and he got high. He's Tommy Chong's like cousin or yeah. whatever, yeah. Oh, I thought they, and they did just like a moved crossover. Everything I over. Like, Whoa. Yeah, I was, I was like, like, hold on. Decades. <laughs> Two yeah. decades yeah. they went across a crossover. I was like, wait a minute. It was a time machine. Hyde was really Tim <laughs> as a kid. Next one. Hyde, oh, he's gone. I'm still doing. Yeah, he did. Well, I don't have any good ones uh, now. Alleged, you're shitting all over my Alleged rapish, raping thingies. Ugh. All right, if I died right now, yes. You know the movie oh. Week- Weekend at Bernie's. <laughs> <laughs> Weekend at Radio Boy. Weekend at Radio Boy. <laughs> Would you be able to pull that off? No. In 20 2020, I'm gonna round it up because we're almost there, right? No, you're getting kind actually. Of big. Hold on a second. Him, yes. He is so I'm high like all the time. People would just think he was half stoned and passed out. Yeah. And we, finally, he might he, get some. He goes, damn it, you <laughs> beat me to it. I was, I was, that's literally what I was going to say. Get as Why is he going to so get laid as a now? dead guy? Oh. He's got a better shot. I got like, my shades on, my like Hawaiian shirt. Like, that has to be the funniest part of Weekend at Bernie's when the chick goes up and bangs him when he's dead. That happened? I don't even remember that movie. Yeah. I was a, such a little kid. Oh, it was so it was a long time ago, but yeah, a chick bangs him while, when he's dead. I can see like you're giving you got the radio man <laughs> doing the, the high five to the dead radio man. Well, he doesn't need a tender anymore. No. <laughs> How did that go? Did we ever get any like legit responses to his tender? I asked this dude for my password so I could have control, see if I get any luck on it because he's just swiping away at all these. Like you can't on go there. make one for yourself. I could pick. Well, I I don't want. Yeah. <laughs> How dare He's you? He's got my email, you know. How like, dare I talk logic? Just want my account. Radio Boy wants his account. We're, we're <laughs> <laughs> Radio Boy. In December, we're doing the dating game. I'm, I'm working on finding DC the, Embre? the girls that want to actually have a date with you. Murdoch said talk to him, I think, right? I'm trying to find <laughs> girls a little more probably in your age range. I feel like Murdoch would probably, he's going to find you some 40s. Well, maybe that's better for him, actually. Now Some experience? Yeah, you that, know. They'll, be, they'll, com- just they'll let, be gentle? They'll let him do whatever he needs to do. Well, you're so cute. <laughs> I'm radio boy. <laughs> that's how he would say it. Too. <laughs> I'm radio boy. <laughs> God, I wish we had cameras in right. here. That was such a genuine, that's exactly the response, and he doesn't even realize that he did it. He he got all he's like I blushing, put on a yep. <laughs> biting his lower lip, all cute like <laughs> acting coy. Hi, radio Hi. boy. I'm radio boy. <laughs> That's creepy. <laughs> that was a little. Uh... I gotta try to do the voice, but like super quiet, because anytime I do it, I'm I'm sounding like radio boy. And I gotta push radio up on my <laughs> push up on my glasses every time. We're the we're the glasses. This is a show, today. by the way. We are live. If you just happen to be stumbling, across, that was all I got for hypothetical. That was not all of them. Was that's it? when you give me fucking nine hours notice. And God I forbid, fucking, nine hours. And I don't have. You know any when I worked weed. at iHeart, my boss would walk in and go, "Hey, I need you to write a script for this, and I need it uh-huh. done in an hour." You got like nine hours. I, this is different. <laughs> he didn't have the proper equipment to get ready for the show today. I was out of weed, man. You can't do that to me. <laughs> don't. Don't stick up for him, GMFB. Thank oh. you, don't, thank you, GMFB. I, I wasn't, I wasn't don't ever... sincere. It was not sincere. And at where all. is your flannel shirt? In in my <laughs> car. My flannel's in my car too. I think. I needed I wood think. shop here, and he's yeah. not here today. Wood shop isn't here. <laughs> yeah, when you're not dressed, well, he's in got that... wood under that apron over there. How awesome is! That? I can't wait for Friday. Shop boy or dick? I think he's gonna get. He, he's it. You're gonna have to beat the chicks off him with that thing, because his brother. We had intern Tyler, who you never met. Um, GMFB, who is legitimately like four inches shorter than than Ryan, and like You've 40, never seen pounds, a picture of? forty pounds heavier. Oh wow! And he put that on with a mask and bo- and boxing gloves because he insisted on having like all of him hidden because he was so scared. And Wait, girls, why were the boxing gloves hiding? He hid his hands. His hands. 
because people would recognize his hand. Yes, he, he wanted all of it hands. covered because he's famous. <laughs> he's he a put hand Ro- model. Ro- he put <laughs> he put. Uh, will you grab the Zoidberg mask? He put the Zoidberg mask on with a purple wig over top the Zoidberg mask while wearing the boxing gloves. Like he was. People would go out of control. He was getting lab dances from chicks because of that apron grinding on him, I gra- bet. grabbing him instead of the apron. Yep. And he he did he d- hair is too too glorious. I don't want you to wear a mask. I want you to wear a hairnet. That'd be way fun because then you take you can take the hairnet off and do well because the, then it's like know. I'm the chef, you know. Yeah, I got the, mm. the gloves chef boy. Like, yes, yeah, it makes more sense. Yeah, that was all Cherokee who with who the Zoidberg mask and the boxing gloves. It lost the whole chef. Bit. It, it did. It did. It made it. it Zoidberg is a doctor, first of all. Doctor Boyard Dick. <laughs> Thank you. I have no idea who Zoidberg is. Futurama? I'm, I'm Zoidberg. Yeah. That's not bad. Thank you. That's not bad. Actually, I know who it is now. Yeah. yeah. I've, I've seen probably 10 to 15 episodes of that show, like start to finish. Futurama is awesome. Futurama's amazing. I'll take your word for it. <laughs> That's all I have to say about He's not that. a big cartoon guy. <laughs> He's told me yeah. that before. You don't watch uh, DuckTales or. Like, no. No, I watch def- Family Guy. Family Guy. Yeah. yeah. But that's actually Simpsons? losing its luster. You like Simpsons? Simpsons, yeah. It's like I mean, Family I, Guy. I, I, family I got Guy's a, not as funny anymore, uh, though. It really is. I got isn't. a I American got a Dad's way better. Disney Plus. I've been watching. A, I'm sorry. I watched a, the first season of The Simpsons, and I've just been powering through that. Even show. Disney cut out the ones with Michael Jackson in it. Really? Why? Because all because of the allegations. the allegations that have been around forever. Literally, <laughs> yeah. Someone just made a documentary about it for once. It's whatever. His music's still okay. So wait, so Disney owns Fox now, right? Yeah. So they own all they of own that. Everything. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, that's... they own Family Guy. Yeah, Family Guy made a joke about how they wanted to get something from Disney, and Disney wouldn't let them. And they, it was in the last episode. It was actually pretty funny. This guy, the last episode, the, the, the final latest finale? episode of, of a Family finale? Guy, a Family Guy. Yeah, the latest episode. It's the latest. Ending. The Tomorrow. one that was on no, Sunday. It's not. It'll never end. <laughs> no. Not as long as it makes money. Nope. The Simpsons will just like keep on barreling show. along. What is Simpsons uh, season 20 or 31? 30, 31 32? 30. Yeah. South Park is on like 20 something, right? Yeah. But that's still. South, South Park, Park is, is at yeah. the top of its game yeah. somehow still. How How is that possible? Because they made they, it out of paper when they first started. But is it still the two guys never held, doing all yeah, the writing? They've never held back. That's the thing is they. they and flex their muscle and said, "We're going to be this inappropriate, and you're going to deal with it." Weren't and they, they like never stopped trying to get canceled? S- semi, they were making yeah. a point because everybody lost their mind over the Apu thing all of a sudden on The Simpsons. Oh right, like but how racist South that character is, even though he's been on the show for you know three decades. <laughs> but South Park can do just mind-boggling things. So they were that's why, yeah, they were doing it out of actually respect to The Simpsons. It was cool. But they've pushed the envelope forever, and it's always current. It's like it's amazing. That's how why current I think it's they, been able to are. do this because they only need the, the few days to prepare. Yeah. They don't need months and months. It's and that's I find that amazing though. You can write a show and do the cartoon work for it and everything in under seven days, and put it out and it's uh, hysterical, and it's spot on. Yeah, that's I just like that's good stuff. I don't watch the show, but I'm, I always find it amazing. Oh, it's I love that show. It's <laughs> I watch like all of South Park and it like like caught me up in the past like 10 years of what's happened or like in a comedic right. way but like not like actually but like so this is what's been going on in the world like, like south the, park like the themes are there you sad know? but like, it's true i mean it, am i right no like, you're not wrong it's still the same topics and everything i'm like wow okay i'm i feel refreshed I mean, it was now. like the daily show it was something that it was comedy but it was a way that you could get news to some people <laughs> yeah, who are right? never yeah. gonna watch the news that but show is the daily show is still spectacular i hate but, that I don't like Trevor Noah. You don't? No, I just don't oh. think he's that funny. And I think his delivery is terrible. Ooh, I disagree. I, I he might have gotten better. I, I, I watched wonderful. I watched right after Jon Stewart left. Jon Stewart. I religiously watched yeah. him and Colbert. Colbert was a thousand times better anyway. Uh, the Colbert Report was... Mm-hmm. was. <laughs> well, there's so many good spinoffs. Yeah. Of, of, you know. We can't but I, I really enjoy Trevor Noah. We can't get into politics though, because then we alienate. You know. Well, then we'll be like every late less night than fifty percent of the population the air right now. Less than fifty. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty close to fifty, unfortunately. It's still less. No, you you get uh, you half. offend the thirty five per. No, so you're gonna get me in trouble right now because I'm about to start <laughs> saying stuff. Yeah, and there then, we go. <laughs> it doesn't you know, take like, much. Yes, yes, do it. <laughs> I wish I was like Murdoch. I, I could have slow played that a you little were, bit. Yeah, you were like, <laughs> do it. <laughs> 
know, he's got no patience. Less than 50 percent. Right? I don't. No. Let the play clock go down, Jeffy. No, hike, hike, hike. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, man. Ugh. Well, that was pretty much you really out of uh, things? Well, my last one was garbage. So oh, well, we got to hear it now, <laughs> man. Wait, it was worse than. Oh, we got. It was probably bad. I said it was like. Uh, <laughs> it was probably bad. It's a. Uh, what if all good foods tasted bad and all bad foods tasted <laughs> good? <laughs> so then it wouldn't matter. That is something my <laughs> seven-year-old would ask. Hey, Dad, what what if pizza tasted like crap and and crappy food I don't like tasted like pizza? I'd be like, well, then you would like you would eat the food you don't like and you wouldn't like you would. Eat you just wait. What's for somebody the next to, question? <laughs> you wait for somebody to take a poop and you just put your mouth there and eat it. I'm like, oh my god, this is like lobster. <laughs> You were watching South Park, weren't you? No, I probably. Eating there's a crap. whole. There's an episode. Yeah, yeah where they where, crap, they, where right? they where they poop out of their mouth, but they shove food yeah. up their ass. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's God, because it's healthier or whatever. So they're oh. they're because bu- they're bypassing whatever yeah, their the stomach. Kids are just like in the bathroom with they're their just lunches. Shoving taco <laughs> quesadilla, carbon yeah. sugar quesadilla up his ass. I've seen that Someone episode. Has, like, a subway well, like, sandwich. That was one of the best ones because they're in the middle of having a conversation. It's like you know what? Wait, like I was like. Oh. <laughs> His turd comes out. Anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> it's, it's wonderful. Oh, if our show could be ten percent as good. Sorry, as that I show. fucking let you down. Maybe a couple more days of notice next time would be. Fantastic. You've been preparing. I spent for... half my day figuring do out you know which I ones I did on the last show. You've had how much time though? We have. We just started recording again. We're in season what now? This is nine. nine year nine here. This is season nine, episode two. I You've know had I the whole nah. break to work on it. <laughs> the whole break. So Uncle it's... Uncle GMFB is about to, to lay fair, the woodshop on I'll, you. I will defend myself with this. After the Imagine first that, hypothetical, somebody defends himself. After the first hypothetically speaking, I started doing a lot more, and then we did one, and I had a lot prepared. But then after the second one, your four twenty one wasn't too bad. The debut, right? Yeah, the debut, and then the second one. Use all of the good the stuff. The second up one was on the whatever, one. and then I crashed and burned. I guess. What? I was just trying to throw stuff at you because you, when we start doing this like daily, well, yeah, we're gonna, then I'll it fucking, needs to be. Oh, you know, then you'll do I it. I literally didn't All know right. we were ever going to do. I'm just gonna, gonna keep kicking that can down the road, again. Donald. Jesus. You know what? When we do it daily, then I'm I'll work on it. Yeah. 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 Right when now, there's blind. a gun to my head, then I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like he was. I, well I would have drank. I would have drank the shake yeah, if you guys yeah. held a gun. To can my we? Head. Can we go back to how you work under pressure? Hey, can you get a rug in that car for us? <laughs> <laughs> I heard about that. Yeah, am I rug boy? <laughs> Did you listen to the show? Did you hear? No, it? no, I didn't. You I, should hear it. Radio rug. Because Murdoch makes it just sound so much worse than it probably was it, it wasn't that bad honestly. i know but he really just wait i did, literally i did, tried all my options and then he like makes it think as i like struggled did you really take a seven by five rug and roll it the seven foot way and try to get it in the car though? i didn't roll it up was it already rolled murdoch rolled it up oh. okay so you, but you didn't unroll it and roll it the other way no but that trunk is pretty big in that car to be fair can fit seven bodies that you could fit a, you huge, could fit a dude. body in there, but, those, but you car. couldn't fit a straight long body. You'd I tried. Have to fold a seven a, foot the, one. I tried it. Trying to get Shaq in there. I tried my trunk. I tried my back seat, and finally worked my front. Okay. I tried all my <laughs> with, options. With half of it hanging out the window. Oh, well, into no. the back. D- did my you have back to put a red was, flag on my, it? My front seat was down, like the the back or whatever, mm-hmm. and I just loaded the car. <laughs> I don't know. I I really wish I could have seen this. If he had it on camera, it probably would be I'm surpri- really funny. He probably does. <laughs> he probably oh, did a murder. He, he drove straight to work like... and he would just laugh as he showed everybody. <laughs> Here's this one of these guys who do radio with who couldn't get a rug in his car, and he just showed every single person. <laughs> <laughs> and it's one of these rugs in here, right? It's this one. It's, yeah, yeah it's this one right here, the one you're the we're on, not the small one. Even though I heard he struggled with the small one too. What? I have a feeling I, he struggles the only a lot. thing I really struggled with is I I set it up. And then it fell over and unrolled. <laughs> <laughs> so and then really, he couldn't figure out how to roll it up. And the, yeah, then I how then I roll rolled it and it flipped up. back. And then I tried to roll it up again. You know, do you a, have to lick it <laughs> like an envelope? <laughs> no, no, like a joint. Like a joint. Like a joint. <laughs> the one time. <laughs> the one time. I didn't think. I thought. I didn't know he was making that reference. It's George. Come on. <laughs> it's seriously. You're, that's all you do is smoke weed. Don't even know. He, he I didn't even know like he knew this, what weed was. He goes like this. I did the hand. The oldest thing. guy in the room this. goes like this, and you're like, <laughs> like an, an envelope. envelope? <laughs> yeah, you didn't even say envelope. You like, envelope. envelope. It's envelope. <laughs> envelope. People say envelope or envelope. Envelope. Caramel. It's like or caramel. Caramel. Uh, uh, Caribbean or Caribbean. 
I like Caribbean. Well, now that you said, I I had time to think about it. <laughs> Ask me again in like Can an hour, and I'll forget about <laughs> it. It's a simple answer. Which one okay, do you say? What, Pirates of the Caribbean is what I think of, so I'll say Caribbean. Oh, okay. you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I I say I Caribbean. Say, I which say, is the right way though? You wouldn't say Pirates of the Caribbean, right? That's what I say. Well, really? Like, yeah. Well, uh, yeah, you don't say Caribbean cruise lines, say Caribbean cruise lines, but you don't say Pirates <laughs> of the Caribbean. You say Pirates that's of the Caribbean. That's what I'm saying, right? Yeah, that's yeah, that's interesting. It's that's like, a better hypothetical. See what we just did? It's like orange or orange. <laughs> we can orange. fire him. No, hold on a second. Orange. Did you hear that? No one says orange. Orange or orange? You, no, no orange. you're just making stuff up. <laughs> People say orange. Orange? Of course they do, because that's the word, orange. But or they orange. say it like differently. Maybe with an accent. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I have a friend who would it's say- It's like caramel or caramel. It's the same okay. thing. I have a How friend have you not heard for this? yellow. This is totally he says thing. yellow. Yellow? Yeah. With an A? <laughs> He's the only person I've ever known who says oh, it. That's that not way. like a tomato. Tomato. That's just I'm from a different else. Like wor- worder. Like people from Philadelphia can't say Word. water or they can't say fifty the right way. Fifty. Yeah, I think it's because they haven't they haven't won a lot of titles in sports. Maybe I don't know. <laughs> 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 they have a hard time spelling ring. True. Ring. <laughs> By the way, <laughs> yeah, he, yeah, we lost him in the sports thing. Yeah, once you check start out, talking sports, check out no ADD idea. Sports. It's an it's another show we're gonna have on here live. Um, by the way, we're going to launch, do I do me and me and you talked about Jim FBI. I told you about doing the re playing like the remix music, mm-hmm. like in between the, the mashups. Yeah. The mashup yes. kind of stuff. I'm you think 100% we should do that in on that for what? Like when we don't have our shows on. Yeah. So you can tune in and hear like stuff that you wouldn't hear on normal stations, like mashups, not, you know what I mean? Like, Where uh, they, they take two songs and put them together. Taylor Swift them? with Eminem, you know, and they like, they, dr- they drop one. What's the one with Lyrics over one beat Mouse and, they, and uh, no, there was like a Disturbed and Ed Sheeran. There's a bunch of them. They're spectacular. I have no I've never heard of this. Modest Mouse and Queen. Yeah, stuff like that. that yeah, that song is ridiculously good. So. I I could listen to that 17 times a day. Just that one song. I don't think I've ever listened to mashups before. We're gonna start doing that because this thing's gonna be live. Like right now, we're just gonna have shows on repeat. So if you miss anything, it's just gonna be a bunch of shows playing mm-hmm. over and over and over again. What about getting a an actual DJ? To mix stuff, do some mixing. DJ Froyo, you know, like on a weekend or something, That's like on a, a on a Friday yeah. night, like I have an actual DJ come in, set up his tables or have a party in here, a little VIP. Well, I, I, I don't. <laughs> think no, once we have the mini fridge in here, like a you, you, we'll, we'll, VIP for five people. It's like the yeah. office when they get <laughs> when they get that like spare room or whatever. Oh yeah, that's, that's exactly <laughs> right. Yeah. <laughs> Or like in here. Dance off. Yeah. <laughs> <There's like laughs> that would have been the best place to work ever. Oh, right? You didn't have to do anything. We should get a studio in that building. <laughs> <laughs> that that dance room. So mm. check us out on Facebook, BS Show. Instagram is uh, BS Show. Twitter's being in super bad. Uh, Friday, like I said, we'll have Chef Boyard Dick out and about. Radio Boys downtown debut Sarasota. Is Chef Boyard Dick. We'll have t-shirts. I didn't get stickers in in time. Ooh, stickers! Um, yeah, I was gonna say we should that. get those. I can just write on some duct tape the BS show. Actually, GMFB, if I if I <laughs> <laughs> I went to Office Max and I got a lot of white stickers and I just I wrote BS show like, on you them. You can do a lot with <laughs> duct tape. Sticks them everywhere. Fix everything with I, duct tape. I went to high school with a guy, Jay Harvey. When right after we graduated, he went and made up little stickers that just said Jay Harvey on them. And you would pull up to McDonald's, and there would be a Jay Harvey <laughs> sticker. And you drive around town. Everywhere you went, you would see oh a Jay God. Harvey sticker. He's probably wanted for felony littering. I always thought it was one of the best things ever, though. You know, he, he wasn't even marketing himself for anything. It's not like he just, had a business. It was just his just, name? Just so he would put his name around that town. He's fucking awesome. Yeah. <laughs> just to be a dick. Yeah. I've always we, thought. Can we make Radio Boy stickers and just give them to random, stick them on random cars? <laughs> yeah, we'll go to. Oh, we'll, we're getting stickers. I was going to. GMFB, uh, if I throw you some cash, do you think I can get you to stop by like Sign Machine? Go, uh, go, go see, see Adam because he does stickers mm-hmm. and he can do it in like one day. Yeah, you can. Yeah, and we don't need a, a lot. I just need like, like, are you are you out and about tomorrow early? Always. Okay, because if we can, uh, I have a hot day tomorrow night though. No, 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 early, 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 early. Frozen early. Two comes out. Yeah. yeah. Really? Let it go. Already. Let it go, but first one came out like yesterday, six years ago. Yeah, <laughs> it's been a while. <laughs> 2013, really? Yeah, wow. I know. Time. Oof. But if, even if we can get, sucks. even if we get 20, 20 or thirty stickers, I can mm-hmm. get him out there with the stickers on top of the shirts. So, yeah. What would it, what does he charge? Do you know? Not a lot. No. No. Yeah, not a lot. All right. But you I'll, guys. But <clears throat> is there, 
Yeah. No, go, go ahead. No, please. Did you guys hand out shirts and stuff last time you did Chef Boyer, Dick? Mm-hmm. Well, mm-hmm. last time we were doing, we had Firewater, uh, the official BS oh, show the band. the CDs, right? We had the CDs, okay. and then we were doing uh, iTunes gift cards for our album. When we were our best of album. Mm. They were just... Because we got everything. They were just we we haven't cards. done a best of in a while. We There's need to do reason. another best of. We're getting enough we, stuff. We, but we have to have some stuff to say, put on there. We've only There's put... a lot of good stuff. Since the, since the, the best of album came out, we've done like about shows. 40, 40 shows, I oh, think, yeah. total, maybe. <laughs> and we have three minutes of good stuff. Aww. So... <laughs> Even though I didn't put everything that was the best of out from the old stuff, I probably could absolutely have done one right, more. Season 12, we'll do another. <laughs> season 12, it's coming. Uh, oh, no, that mystery up. shake is a bit all on its own from last year. That was Ooh. amazing. I was listening to that today, driving here. That's and a good I was, I was I've gone back and listened to that one. Actually, it's like you can go through everyone's any, trying to get any part puke, of it, and puke, it's so funny. And you're and you're trying. You're like, just shut up, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, it got worse. I, I, I still remember it. I have flashbacks. Yeah. I don't even want to think about that shake. You took a sip. I tasted it. That's I know. And I'm listening back. I He's describing like, yeah, it was just it was terrible. And then I, and I'm, as I'm listening, I'm like, because I I turned it on, and it was right after you had slammed Chugged it. it. And I'm thinking, wait a minute, you dick, radio man! Like you drank like one teeny bit, and this guy was all. Gl- gl- I did. You can see his Adam's apple count. like cha chunk, cha chunk. On air, they didn't know that. <laughs> Not until the video came out, suckers. <laughs> radio man's like, I got, but I got. Radio boy strikes again. He goes like, I got this. Nope, I'm out. That's how. That's how much he drank. That's how quick it went. He's like, I got this. Yep. Nope. He put it to his lip, and it touched his lip, and he was. Oh, done. but dude, just the smell of that. Can it, you blame me? To be though? fair, though, to be fair, GFB, you did the same thing initially. You went, no. Nope. Yeah, I could not get. I, and then, I knew I was gonna vomit. And I'm then like, Cherokee I can't, laid I that gauntlet down. down yeah, and said, "You don't ever get to say anything about me again unless you drink that." And he said, <laughs> <laughs> "Tell me when to stop." Yeah, I didn't have any steaks. You know? Please, um, I have some more. You had steaks. Yeah, you you lost. You were you lost yeah, the, so, yeah, the yeah, challenge, whatever. right? What did he lose the the bingo that year? Yeah. But if, that it, was, if, it's, if it's like I didn't drink the shake, I had to do something else, right? That's what it should have been. Like no, I should have had to get the right. tattoo. No, it went to a vote. Right. We should we should make you do something for that still. That's what I'm saying. I'll drink the Thanksgiving shake, bro. I know He's there like, won't be yeah, sardines I and fucking gravy shit and... in there. How do you know? <laughs> How do you know? It's the worst Thanksgiving recipes. Some of them are bad. I'll we'll find something from like Tibet. Tibet from, Thanksgiving. Ooh. From Dubai. <laughs> Dubai. <laughs> Yeah, they got money there. All that stuff's probably really good. Yeah. <laughs> Can we get super good worst think, Thanksgiving foods? What? Why do? You, what do you have against Dubai? Like, you want to put a sinkhole there? I know you're like Murdoch with the Haitian stuff. Oh, it's just like yeah. a tall building. I could pick anywhere. You don't there. like tall buildings? Oh, I just want to see it sink. My dad was killed by a tall building. You say, did <laughs> Spider Man hurt you? Yeah, Batman killed my tall building <laughs> father. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I think on that note, I'm going to wrap this thing up. <laughs> Hypothetically speaking, are we live? What if my dad was a building? We've theoretically <laughs> been live this whole time. That was wonderful that we were live the whole time, and we we're like, "Are People we live?" Can witness that train wreck. We've been live for 58 minutes. We've only been that was an hour. We've only been recording for about 51. <laughs> so anybody who tuned in right at eight o'clock, like in a little af- right after oh, that, they, they got like a bonus. A- Stuff that's out in the ether that'll never be back. That's again. like a little. Uh, that pre- was when you guys were talking about your drug dealers. A little pre-show. Uh-huh. <laughs> a little pre-show. <laughs> that was oh, you. We were. You left Whoops. your wallet. <laughs> Wait, that when no, he left the wallet. No, it's in the ether. That, that, it's in the ether. <laughs> Did you can't pull it? stuff back from the ether. <laughs> no, your mic wasn't even on for that. Oh, you're right. Was it? No, no I think by then it was on. Me and Jay, I know you were talking about some X over here. So. <laughs> yeah, one's talking about dropping Molly, the other's talking about leaving wallets in his drug dealer's car. Whoa! But are we recording? Ether. <laughs> hey. Well, you and I, Jay, we were talking the other day about how we we're, we'll we'll do a show, and then we won't know if we said something on the air or if it was it's we were just true. talking. That's what I said. Yeah. I did it, it to Team Patrick last yeah. week, and I made him sound like a serial killer because we were talking <laughs> oh, about stuff yeah, off air. We didn't well, even mention. If you look at him, it's not a far stretch. Oh, come on. You guys say we look alike, That's so why I know like, what you're doing. A little bit. When we get in the room, Mike's bit. on live. That, no, that's a bad idea. Well, people get the pre-show, you know? Yeah, but here's the difference. <laughs> not that we – I think – I think only maybe two times in the last four months did I have to edit anything out, and it was it was related to me being in that building when, yeah. at GMFB Studios. We don't have a safety net anymore. We only use that safety net like twice. Now it's if you say something, it's curse splat. 
right? So if well, you if you or Murdoch or someone says something, there's no more, hey, he'll get that in post because there's no more post for me to get that in. I just want you guys to realize yeah. that now. Hey, so they, so they, you yeah. better believe and stand behind what you say. Hey. I love the way you word it. There's no more post, man. There's, <laughs> it's gone. He used to have to do it all the time because when we would do the sports show to begin with. And I would oh, mention. The sports, you guys are way worse than the sports show. I would show. say something about yogurtology all the time. And, he, and here's Jay in the background waving his arms. <laughs> Oh, well, you know, that. you work at Yogurtology. Oh, well, that's right. I can't say Yogurtology. I'm, I'm not allowed to say oh. that you work at Yogurtology. I'm not allowed to say that. Yogurt. Fuck that place. Oh. Well, now you can say that till the. Till yeah, it doesn't matter. I die. Although that uh, Fruity Pebbles yogurt they had there. They don't make it anymore. That stuff was spectacular. I never see the flavor there. It yeah. probably comes around seasonal, right? When, when somebody was the GM there, I'm trying to remember who that was. That was a good time. Was flavor of the month in like January. How right? badass did we? We were man, we ran. Oh, that I killed store. that fucking store, man. The waffle cones, they don't do that anymore. We change the flavors constantly. We don't do that anymore. Like once a they week, don't? we would switch out a bunch of them. How is it still there? It's they were be struggling gone too, when right? they when they brought me in. They were about to close it down. <laughs> And then I and got still I got the store the first later. what we had like three one hundred or four hundred or one hundred three or four in a row yeah. on the inspections. Yeah. We were and then our building started crushing falling the sales. Apart. Yeah, then the roof <laughs> caved in in the middle of a shift. Did and it really? And yeah. our freezers broke. No, no, that's a legit story. Like water was pooling and there was these drips, and I'm like, I'm pretty sure because the roof right. was starting to. It was literally it was like starting these, to sag. Like, it was like these, and it was starting to get that dark color. Yeah. And, and and my boss, my boss's boss, was like, No, it's nothing. It's nothing. In the oh, middle yeah. of a shift. Yeah. Water. I mean, it looked like like a bathtub was up in the ceiling. You know, ceiling tiles aren't supposed to change color. Like, oh. have a water ring, yeah, and, and it gets bigger and bigger. That's not supposed to happen. It's like, <laughs> so, hey, it's like it's getting a pudge. Like, it's yeah. pregnant. Like, how? Hey, when did your what building came <laughs> My over water here? Water broke. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, don't worry about that. Was, nothing to see there. It was uh, <laughs> nothing to see. I I I, I, I vowed it us to never be that corporate. All right. You guys, Good. you call me. If the ceiling is caving in, I will believe you, and I will come fix it. I won't just ignore you and pretend that it's not happening. Ooh, is Murdoch listening? Is he? No, I it's just... a, probably a Murdoch concert. It's a video. <laughs> oh, we... Do we have a live Murdoch concert where we get Should out we of here? Play it? Hold on. I, I don't know. It might be risky. Playing one Uh-oh. we don't know what it is. <laughs> oh, that's always worth it. Oh, it is something from a hospital. I didn't get. That was it. What did did he he say? say? I need headphones to listen. Rape. They're running. They're They're running running from me. Yeah, they're running. Yeah, I couldn't. (laughs) That's what it sounds like. Yeah, I couldn't. I couldn't. Yeah, he's got cojones, man. I could. I can't do that. Every time you try, you. I. I would do the same. I drop the phone. Home breaks. You gotta like cheekily. Bring out your phone with the camera and then like hold it down and pretend you're not doing anything. It's like he's it's, got years of experience. Yeah, yeah. He, he probably doesn't care like Hashtag I do. Subtle. Like I'm scared. He doesn't care, so he walks like he's filming probably, and then like call like he's on the phone with himself. Like uh, da, oh, da, da, like da, he's da. FaceTiming. Yeah. yeah, but really he's mm. recording mm. on the phone with himself. People in their <laughs> worst moments. <laughs> I told you I tried getting a picture for these guys at my daughter's school. And a flash goes off when I was taking the picture, and I'm like, uh, uh, and the click sound too. I'm an idiot. This guy. Yeah, I'm not slick at all. Not at all. <laughs> Did the sound go off and everything? Did yeah, everything. Know? A flash, the sound. Everyone stopped and looked at me, and I was like, oh, yeah, nothing to see here. <laughs> the music stopped. I don't know how to work a camera. <laughs> yoga, yoga You're pants. probably wondering how I got into this mess. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> yoga pants. <laughs> You literally, you would be the Ferris Bueller, like, Wait, record the, screech. The camera stops. I'm like, it's panning. And you see eight cops running at GMFB with the billy clubs <laughs> out. You're probably wondering. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> all right, you want to know how horrible I am? One time, a long time ago, I looked at my friend, and I was like, man, you look like a crack baby on chemo. Oh he started chemo two days before that. You're welcome. Holy yeah. shit. Two days before that, he started chemo. And he's like, no, you didn't know. And I'm like, what are the odds that I call somebody a crack baby on chemo? And they started chemo two days earlier. Wow. Yeah. Radio Man, any final thoughts? Are, wow. we, still, are we still going? Or? <laughs> on what? Are we, we're still recording. Right? Yeah, no, I'm still recording. <laughs> okay. still I re- saw you press no, the button No, I went to go. I, w- I, I almost. I, 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 I probably should have. <laughs> yeah. I think now I'm going to. 
pull the ripcord like, on this that, thing. Are we off? I'm like, GMFB I, is. I don't. I don't have this words one time. To I called that. this dude who was going through chemo a crackhead. <laughs> oh, no, a crack baby on. A chemo. Crack baby on. I'm sorry. Let me walk that back. Scratch for a that second. from the record. <laughs> You've come alive tonight, His name GMFB. was Jay Ali. He's starting to, he's fe- he's feeling the Murdoch. He's <laughs> my inner Murdoch. <laughs> I gotta put on some weight, though. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Not much, but a little bit. I gotta grow a little As bit. you're pushing out your... <laughs> <laughs> I know. It's over-exaggeration. Uh, yeah. All right. Well, we'll be back Friday. Uh, I'm gonna say live 8 o'clock. That's a good time to shoot for, right? <laughs> Not 7.30. No, not 7.30. How long did I sit there today? And did you, you get here right at 7.30? Be, I got here before 7.30 because I thought we were going to start recording at 7.30. Like, when you say 7.30, I think we're well, going to start you, recording at 7.30. To be fair, you said you were going to let me know for sure you were coming. And I you said never 75%. Did. I'm sorry. Is 75 100? <laughs> I figured I'd give you guys the pleasure of me surprising <laughs> no. you. No. <laughs> I was charging my car because I have an electric car, which is becoming a big pain in my ass all the time <laughs> because, of, <laughs> because of how far the I've studio noticed. is from where I live right now. So the fact that I have to drive 40 <laughs> round miles where I'm going, i got to charge my car almost every day. Hey, hey, the rent here makes it worthwhile. It does, though. It does. I'm not going to lie. Shout but out that's to the why. rent. So I was sitting at Whole Foods. God, I'm full hippied out. I'm sitting at Whole Foods charging my electric car, <laughs> eating it. my vegan pizza. And then you texted me, and I was getting ready to unplug it because I was waiting because I didn't I didn't hear from you. And you did, you're right. You're right. You did say 75%. But because I didn't hear from you going, I'm on my way or I'm definitely yeah. going, I was waiting on him. So when he said, hey, I'm on the way. Then I was like, I'm gonna leave. And then you were like, Hey, where are you at? And I was like, Where oh. is everyone? I got here at like seven twenty. At least he well, was on time. I got back to my house at seven twenty. Early. <laughs> I'm early. Okay, I'm right. never You're on time. Bad. I'm always early. I appreciate. I appreciate that. You so know I do. I'm bad that Friday, way. Friday. Fried eggs. You guys will be doing fried eggs. You guys will be doing a show in here, right? Well, we're, well, we're all meeting here. Right. And but then I'm gonna send you and Cherokee out. Um, are you guys gonna be on mic so yeah. at the studio? Yeah, we'll check yeah, in with I'm you saying, guys. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Cherokee will film it, and uh, actually, I'm gonna see if I get Cherokee to do Twitch, to do Twitch and Twitch. Um, and Facebook. I can Is do Patrick Twitch. gonna be here? Patrick should be here. I can do Twitch on my phone and just give it to him. And then That's what I'm saying. Do we'll do, we'll do two. We'll either send Patrick if if Dirty. And by the way, cover a few more last second things here. Dirty Marble of isn't officially gone yet. I I, I he. <laughs> Which I'm sure he's listening oh, right now. Oh man, no! Come on, I want to hear this. Is I this marble. good gossip? He was just no. He was just like, hey man, I did, uh, I just had a lot going on. I didn't quit the show. I hope you know that. I, I saw the the group chat stuff, and I was just like, oh, well, they think I'm, they think I'm. Well, should we I let quit. him know that there's two group chats going on? One that he's not involved in. I don't know. Should we, we start? Gotta, a- we got to let everybody know. There's like six group chats that. I know, there's seriously. probably I want to ask. There's something. at least one group chat. I want to ask. All of you aren't in. I, I, is there one? Group chat? Right. You <laughs> is, have a chat with everyone. I yeah. have my own personal group chats with everyone. Radio boy, I me was like, and you got to get a chat together. Right. I was like, is it maybe? No. <laughs> <laughs> he, I knew he, he was going to say. Yeah. No. Wait He's a like, minute. Yes. Wait. No. Who am I talking to? No. No. That's GMFB. No. Oh, wait. You're not Murdoch. Sorry. Absolutely no. not. Uh, I'm scared to start one with there, Murdoch. Is there a chat with me not in it? <laughs> Yeah, Probably. the rest of them. <laughs> Probably. I want to know. Every once in a while, Murdoch will send one out, and there'll be like four people or three people, and I'm like, <laughs> I think he just gets excited to send a video and can't find the actual the group chat, one? and then goes, shit, uh, GMFB, uh, Radio <laughs> Man, I just got to send the video, and then sends the video. How many people is he texting? Because they're like in the first six text messages yeah, I think on there's my one. phone or the both group. The other, what was it? Was it today or yesterday? It was you guys were doing on both of them. You guys were sending stuff on on the two different yeah. chats. Yeah, that's why I'm saying. I'm I like, think which he's one confused. do I respond to? Because he's like, "Hey, you guys want to see this these text this messages?" Video. And then I'm like, <laughs> and everyone's like, "Yeah." And then Wait, no. and then no, nothing comes through on that one. And then 20 minutes later, a different group yep. text comes through, and it's just the text messages unprompted. Yeah. The first group we got to get that organized. Like, Brant was like, "Yeah, send it," and then he didn't send anything and sent it in another, another group chat <laughs> without. Dirty I think Marvel. he was, oh, scro- was the one maybe that, he that screwed that with Dirty Marvel. Oh, just to be a like dick, keeping him on the yeah. hook. Yeah, like, yeah, let's see it. Well, bring. I want if Dirty, Dirty Marvel. Marvel if Dirty Marvel comes out Friday, then I'm going to send him and Cherokee with you, and then I'll probably have uh, Pat, Pat, Team Patrick and Murdoch in the studio with yeah. me. Well, did we ever fig- figure out because Dirty Marble and Cherokee lost? Didn't right. they tie for the loss? Right. 
they they don't have a punishment. Well, they yet. were gonna they do. They have to be Chef Boyardee. They were gonna That's do. That's their punishment. That seems like a really good punishment. I kind of want to be Chef. Yeah, Boyardee. you we we need it. <laughs> That's moving the tender bit along by you being Chef Boyardee. Okay. So I yeah. think that has to to play I'd out. I'd send them to the cheetah. But Cherokee's face, by the way, in here on Friday, and we're like, hey man, you know you lost the. Uh, <laughs> he's like, yeah. He's like, I know. Yeah, I heard. Yeah, he's like, and this, he just went completely. He went from all jokey to. <laughs> and then and then we were all laughing and he still wasn't He wasn't laughing. laughing. He wasn't yeah, he wasn't funny for him. <laughs> like, oh. I mean, what's the worst that we can do to him? We made him drink a shake and a he didn't even shake. drink it. Maybe maybe so, him so and uh saying. maybe him um, and uh Dirty Marble can do the um the Thanksgiving shake with you. We should have them when we uh bring in the gay guy to ask a gay guy, have the two of them make out and then have the gay guy judge if it's a good make out session or not for two guys. Sh- shake shake tribution. Thank you for Shake thank you for trying to keep it away from what he I was just going. Ignored he went he right said. into making and out with dudes. <laughs> said, yeah. If I ever, if I, I want to bring him to me with parties. If I ever need to get out of an awkward conversation, I know <laughs> he will just start talking about making out with dudes. Get over here. And I, <laughs> oh hey, come here. I, have you guys met my <laughs> friend George? Come here, come here. George, tell him about that one radio idea you had. <laughs> what? He's like, so two dudes make out on air. As I slip away. <laughs> and then he's we have like a gay have guy fun. judge it. And they just walk away from him, so he doesn't just no it. harm, no foul. He's yeah. like, where are you going? He's still talking to himself. <laughs> right? <laughs> it happens a he's lot like, at so the party. bit is we get two dudes and, I wonder and where nobody's that, there. I wonder where that apron is. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, oh, it's in my car. Let me go get it. Let me show you. Leave the house and we lock the door. <laughs> All right. Oh, by the way, I'm gonna post the uh, video. Send me a- again of the. Uh, I don't know why it sent so of, small. Yeah. See if you can send it to me again. Maybe also, not we need as to small. post studio pictures. Yeah, we'll post those too. Um, just so people can get an idea what's going on Friday. Mm-hmm. And since we didn't do a show Monday, we owe them some kind of content. I'll do Chef Boyer Dick. Um, so we'll get those videos. Up. I'm gonna get those videos up tomorrow. Send that to me tonight. I'm gonna have that videos up tomorrow. If you're listening live right now and you want to hear a replay of the show. Probably the morning. I'm not gonna lie to you because I got to edit in an intro and an outro. I didn't have. I don't have our actual station Smells computer set up like yet. Outro. What? I don't know what he said. I just I, pity. It's a laugh. Friday joke. What? One more Indo time. Smells oh. more like outro. All right. All right. We like weed jokes. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> but the one time he I makes a weed joke, you don't put jokes. him. Oh, I, you don't respect the, it. He did the do you say respect? Uh, maybe. He I'm said say respect. <laughs> Oh, it was an urban word. We didn't give you an urban word tonight. You need to get live urban mm-hmm. words. From I you. had a woman in my car from Memphis, and I asked her if oh she God. knew if she knew what ba- Babbage was. Babbage? <laughs> Did she, she goes? She goes. You must be old. <laughs> Not it's even an lying. Old she urban goes. Word? She goes. That that's that's well, dated. To be fair, he did kick it back in the old days. When yeah, was, but back she, when he was getting did. your mom pregnant, she so. was like 40, 42, <laughs> and she did. She she said that that's an old saying. Right but around Murdoch's age, and yeah. Ooh. She's from Memphis, though, so. Did it, you meet my mom? Your mom? Yeah. <laughs> Mur- Murdoch's ex? <laughs> my dad. Yeah. Murdoch's my dad. Yeah. <laughs> you get it? Wait, are you being serious <laughs> about the Memphis thing? Yes, now? I'm 100% serious. I love how he's got people getting his car, and he's like, so have you ever heard of this he, uh, like, ghetto he, like, gang word? The gang She's signs from Memphis. Or whatever. I mean, and it's, I'm not scared to ask somebody something. I mean, what? Are you that irritating Uber driver that asks all the questions? Do you know what Babbage what? means? Yeah, <laughs> nonstop. Nonstop. <laughs> Hey, welcome to GMFB's Uber. I, I need you to fill this pamphlet out so I know what your favorite sports teams right. are. What do you find offensive? <laughs> I'm going to try this experimental bit, okay? There's two dudes in my Uber car, and they make out. I need you guys <laughs> to make out right now. I have a radio show. It'll, it makes yeah. sense later. You don't have to pay the fare if you make out. <laughs> That's when they're like, what's the camera for? Yeah, yeah you know. Security. <laughs> we... <laughs> We need to talk about one of the ideas we had about you and the Uber, anyway. Doing, like, taxi cab confessions, but, more like, you know, Uber. Duber. Basically, Uber confessions, but. Uber. Right. Do it not Ooh. on Uber's dime, but if we do exactly. it. Exactly. We, 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 trust me, I've got ways around that. I'll explain yeah. off air that we have to do that, but we definitely need to do that. I, I, actually, oh, I can actually. Can we get GMFB to do cash cab? That was the other idea that I had. <laughs> A very similar, similar idea. Yes. But, but we give away our BS show yeah, or ADD course, Sports merch money. because we're not giving money I away. I told Fuck you that. the other morning <laughs> I picked cab. a girl up, and then she was having a conversation on the phone, and I'm just like, there's something not right here. I'm like, this girl's a drug dealer. Because it was, it was like 
five o'clock in the morning. Play and, guess your occupation. And it just it would have been easy. Drug dealer or he gets hooker. Shanked. And she she was a hooker. She hangs up the phone and she's like, Yes, I'm an escort. And I'm like, Okay. And then she starts telling me stories. Then oh. you should I could just imagine you being like are you really an escort or are you a hooker? Because <laughs> there's a difference. Is there a difference? <laughs> Isn't there like a money difference? Like I, once I think... you start charging thousands, don't you get elevated to like escort? Whoa. Like if it's I five dollars think... for a handy, isn't it like a prostitute? I think technically now they all just say escort because it's more. Because it's, it's, it's escorts more classy. Cause, yeah, because if you're like a, if you're is? like if you do trash, you're like a, a waste management engineer. You're not a trash man. Mm-hmm. So if you're like oh, a right. like a hooker, you're an escort. <laughs> you're like a like a pro, a sexual purveyor. Hold on, uh, <laughs> I'm trying to think. How would you how would sexual you class purveyor that? Purveyor of genitalia. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, they used to advertise on the back page on Craigslist. Oh, escorts or prostitutes? Escorts. Well, it's the same thing. That's why it was the, the same. Pr- thing. I think it's a price difference. Yeah. Though. But escorts are on Craigslist. I don't and know then if they're classy. I was the first time I found out about it, and the guy <laughs> showed it to me. Three girls that used to work at Rico's the pimp? were in there. Some guy, some guys like uh, my friend's sister is on there and was showing me his buddy's sister that's on there. And I'm like, I know that girl. I know that girl. I know that <laughs> girl. Three girls that were on there I knew from Rico's. It's like, man, they went in the right direction. <laughs> Oof, man. Oh. That's interesting. In the right direction, straight to rock bottom. Seriously. I'm not sure how teasing Friday led to this, but uh, yeah. It so, happens. Chef Boyard Dick. I might Boyard get shanked Dick. by an escort. That's what's going to Escort shanking. I, I should have got her number for you. Eh. I, yeah. Pass. <laughs> He's like, that's a hard pass. I have Tinder. <laughs> <laughs> and it's really working. I'll take that over an, an escort. A lady of the night. <laughs> How do you know there's not escorts on Tinder? Oh, there's probably... Can we call it Goober Confessions? Be like George's Goober. Uber or GMFB's Ooh, Uber? Goober uh, Confessions. Goober, Goober Cab Confessions. G- GMF Uber. GMF I think Uber. we might have to get rid of the Uber thing altogether. Just yeah, you can't. I mean, if we pa- well, we're parroting it. Yeah, yeah. Let's call <laughs> it the Uber Cash Cab. Let's just completely <laughs> not we, ripping off we, two. We call it Uber. Well, that makes it that that cancels each other out on the yeah. copywriting. Obviously, yeah. it's like if you're copywriting infringing on two, it's none. Right. We it's, call it Duber, and we force negative. people to listen to my shitty hypothetical questions while I get stoned and drive them around. Duber, though, that actually is pretty funny. Duber. Because they made a mo- movie, Stuber. Stuber. Right? Stuber Duber. Duber, Duber but with, yeah, GMFB. GMF Boob. Goob. GMF Boober. <laughs> I've got, I've Boober. I've got some ideas that I'm going yeah. gonna, gonna, I'm gonna to run by you. All right. But, yeah, tune in Friday. we got all that going on. And check out the Facebook because we should have you guys live on there and on our Twitch. Uh, Radio Man will get back on Twitch soon. Who? Radio Boy. <laughs> Excuse me. I really love that he's embraced he this right embraced away. It. it took less than 10 seconds for him to uh, embrace maybe the Radio he's got, Boy. Maybe Damn he's, right I'm maybe Radio he's got Boy. a girl on down the line. He knows that something's coming, so he's like, yeah, I'll be Radio Boy for a week. Whatever. <laughs> yeah, right. What's the worst? <laughs> Radio I'll be Radio Boy. Boy for a long time. Well, Radio Boy will get the Twitch stuff going <laughs> again, right? We got this nice nifty green screen that we need to, to use also when you're not at home doing, doing nothing. <laughs> I guess you can't really stream from home either, can you? Nope. So, yeah, this week we got a lot of recording we need to do. We need to get the new outro done for the show. The new uh, uh, bit? Or what do we call oh, it? Oh, yeah. My, the new scripted. Oh, yeah. we, we, uh, got some, we got some good things that we've already kind of penciled out we need to record. Yeah, you look I don't very know what, excited. A, a that, sketch? That smile right? on yeah. your face. A, yeah. a new sketch? Yeah, we got some stuff to do. So I'm going to – everybody needs to pick a day with me to, to come in here and be able to record, even if it's for an hour, even if it's for 30 Sluver minutes. Sluver day. Flandron day. <laughs> I don't know We're ending the show so well, and then he just goes and he just and he gets. Like, you said pick a is day. Is it a rug? Bro. Did the show become a rug? You say pick did the show a day. become fabric? You said pick a day. Did the show become I pizza? A day. He's sobering up. I picked a day for real. Yeah. Hey guys, you didn't even give me a break to go smoke again. What the fuck is this? I love how you use the f word. It really is like <laughs> a person who's using it for the first time and their parents aren't around. It's like <laughs> <laughs> we've been pretty clean. Very I curse few. a lot, though. Yeah, my, like, he said it like vocabulary. three times today, That's and not too I just—it always entertains me when he uses the F. What the fuckers? Fucking fucking hackers! Freaking hackers! Radio boys, those freaking hackers! Oh my god! <laughs> wow! Radio boys. You know, I think on that, I think we're gonna wrap this thing up. Radio boys, says you're fi- welcome. Final words. Happy anniversary, Nicole. Aww. I love you. I'm radio boy. <laughs> <laughs> From <laughs> Jesus, it's radio boy. For the dirtiest of marbles, DJ, oh, what, what, what were we calling him? DJ, what? Oh, 
what was he calling him? DJ No More? No, uh, DJ... Uh, DJ Once Upon a Time? DJ Once Upon... <laughs> for DJ Once Upon a Time, t- <laughs> Team Patrick, Cherokee o- Frank, O-U-A-T. Owl- Radio Owl- Man, Owl- GMFB Murdoch, I am being... We'll see you guys on Friday. You're welcome. You've been listening to The BS Show, starring B. I feel like I'm taking crazy pills! The coolest guy in the room, Cherokee Frank. Family papers? Uh... Matthew McConaughey's illegitimate love child, Wooders. You know, bring us two absolute quarantines for five minutes until one of us passes the fuck out. Questions, comments, concerns, or think you can do it better? Hit us up on Facebook at The BS Show. For all other BS, check us out on Instagram at BS Show or on Twitter at Bean and Superbad. Thanks for listening. And until tomorrow, always remember... What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. At no point in your rambling, incoherent response were you even close to anything that could be considered a rational thought. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to it. I award you no points, and may God have mercy on your soul. I agree.